Okay. All right. Welcome to General Botany Laboratory. Um, this is basically the first class because I don't want to have to teach it again. Um, you know, next week. Uh, today is the, the campus is closed, but there's no reason that you should stop studying. Um, for right now, uh, if you have this manual, you're good. If you do not, I would prefer if you have it by next week. Um, also, I have this book, but it's the uh, seventh, yeah, seventh edition. You should have the eighth edition. But if you don't have the eighth edition, um, the seventh edition works. Just the pages will be completely off. Um, so let's see. Uh, why don't we get started with uh, first thing um, in your lab manual? At least if you've read it, you should know all the parts of a microscope. Um, I'm going to show you how to set up your microscope and hopefully you don't have um, motion sickness by the time this is over. Um, you should have done the pre-lab questions. Uh, those will be due next week. Um, at the beginning of class, I'm not going to have people have it turn in late um, because that will be uh, the grade for your uh, exercise, your lab exercise this week, for this week. Um, so what we're going to do is go through the first thing, the microscope. Um, and if you hold on for just a second, let me show you. All right. So, what you'll do is, this is your microscope. Um, basically, you're going to undo that. Put that on to the side and see this right here. If you ever want to move it for a long distance, what you're going to have to do is tilt it and push, push, pull it towards you. Do not move it across the table. If you do, it makes this sound. And that's basically all of this stuff inside shaking around. So the very first thing you want to do is make sure that that's unraveled, and then you're going to use some lens paper to make sure this stage is all the way down. Make sure it's set at the lowest setting, the nose piece. Make sure you use the lens paper, because if you use your sleeve, you're just going to scratch it up. You're going to wipe the aperture. You're going to wipe the oculars. Very first thing. Now, sometimes you'll have this top piece right here. It might be kind of wonky. Uh, it might have to be turned around. Um, now, these don't seem to have that problem. So then you plug it in. I can't tell you how many times I've had this problem. People don't know how to plug in a microscope. The outlet's actually right here. 
And so, what we do is sometimes you don't even see the light on. Well, there's this turn, turn on switch right here. So, now you should see the light on. If you do not see the light on, there's a knob. Here, let me show you. So here's the turn on switch. Turn it off. Turn it off. Here's the knob that will basically set the brightness of your light source. And so what we're gonna do is because this is all the way set down, um, if you know what this is, basically that's your fine adjustment knob. This is your coarse adjustment knob. The big thing. Um, <clears throat> so make sure that's all the way down. And so this bar on the side here. This bar right here. Will let you move your slide around. So what we're going to do is you're going to go to my next video and I will show you um, how to use uh, the microscope with slides.